Hello guys, it's Aleš and Radek from European Coffee Tree. And in this video, we will show you how to use this coffee brewer. It's called Decanta. It comes from Fram, it's brand new and we'll brew a cup of coffee together. So Decanta. Decanta was developed by Marco, who is a 2017 French barista champion. And he was competing for the last two years. And in 2016, he took a very interesting aspect of coffee brewing. It's a, how air in coffee influenced the taste and aroma. And he took his experiments and turned them into the new product. And the new product is called Decanta. He sent it to us just before the release so we can test it out. And we've been playing for about a week. And in this video, I would like to share some pros and cons and kind of basic how does it work? So brewing coffee using decanta is fairly simple. You start with 38 grams of coffee. In our case, we get coffee from Cafes Luga, from the guys. It's a naturally processed Ethiopian coffee with a variety called mocha. So it's called mocha conga. And we would grind it a little bit coarser than for Chemex, but a little bit finer than we would need for French press. So this is the grind side, this is important. And then we add the paper filter and rinse it. In, the, in our case, we don't take the paper filter out of decanta, but we will use handle to take water out and keep the paper filter inside of the brewer. Then we need 500 grams of hot water and we would start with blooming. So it has a two blooming phases, each for 20 seconds. And then we add the remaining water and we can control the flow of water. We can control the resulting time, but that's it. That's the simplest way how you use decanta for making coffee. If you look at Decanta, you would probably think like what kind of Chemex it is. And that's right, this is what we were thinking in the very beginning. But if you look a little bit closer, you realize that there are a few things that makes a big difference. And one of the first thing is paper filters that are used. These paper filters are called Phoenix 70 and they were developed by St. Anthony Industries. And similar to Marco, they came to the conclusion that 70 degrees angle of paper filters is the most suitable for coffee brewing. Another feature you realize is the handle of the Decanta. It's it's actually not just a handle, but it's the way you pour water out of the decanter, but also how you control the flow of water coming through the filter and coffee while pouring. And this way you can actually control the brew time and how fast water goes through the coffee. Third feature that makes decanter different is actually the bottom part. And inspired by wine industry, it helps you to introduce air to coffee much more quickly. So it results in the very interesting aroma and also helps you to taste your coffee early in the process because you cool it down quickly. So let's talk about pros and cons. And I think it's good to start with pros. So the first thing is that having Decanta, you have one tool that does it all, meaning like you have a coffee brewer, but you have also the carafe that you can use for serving coffee to your friends. You can use Decanta to brew coffee for more than one or two people. We were using 500 grams of water, but I believe you can use even more. And water actually goes through the coffee bed without any problem. This was the issue with Chemex. You need to steer it and helps it to flow. But but in Decanta, probably because of the angle of paper filter, it was not the case at all and it, everything was pretty smooth. You don't need to take paper filter out of the brewer. This is also very important. You don't make any mess and it's very easy. And also the paper filter is perfectly attached to the brewer. You can much more easily control the flow of coffee brewing. You can grind a little bit coarser, but then if you need, you can slow down the whole process, slow down the process of water coming through the coffee bed using your thumb as a plug. Okay, so let's talk also about some negative things when it comes to decanta. First thing is that it's actually a little bit difficult to clean. Decanta has rather small hole that makes access to the whole surface inside of decanta quite difficult and it's more demanding for keeping the brewer clean all the time. Another thing is that obviously made out of glass, it's prone to be broken and we need to make sure that we have it on the right position on our table so it doesn't fall down, doesn't break because it looks wonderful and we don't want to destroy it. 
In our case, we found out that the spout of decanter is a little bit crooked. That makes it difficult for us to pour coffee straight into our cup. So that might be just the case of our test sample, but if not, we need to learn how to pour it properly. Last thing we find a little bit difficult is to use a handle after rinsing the paper filters because you use a handle to take water out, but in the same time, the hot water actually warm the glass. And then if you hold it, it's not very pleasant to keep it for long long time at the same time you need to use it for controlling the flow so maybe this is the new feature or something that they can change for the for the future overall we really like it we really like decanta we are looking forward to brew more coffee and test it with our friends and we encourage you to give it a try and test decanta for yourself so we hope that you enjoyed this video this is decanta we had a great fun testing it so let us know in the comments what you think and Thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, smash the like button, subscribe, and we will see you next week in the next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.